too far ahead. The way that priest tripped all of your protective runes, it's almost like they're working against you, Relasi. No! Get him! <laughs> I know that Fetcher's here somewhere. Let's see if we can draw him out. And the talisman is mine! You know, if you know what he saw. How could the Lark have known? He has the talisman! The real talisman! 
The High Priest refused my order to take the relic off display. He thinks it's safe, as long as he's watching it. But the, that arrogant sweat! And if that foolish priest hadn't prematurely set off my runes, I'd have clipped the lark's wings and had him dead to rights! A story. Great. What reason would this elder have to visit the... Wait. 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 Did you read this? His legend says the relic holds this eye of Bandar. Keep an eye on that elder. If he's really involved, he may not know the danger he's put himself in. Believe. Go ahead. I'll meet up with you soon. They're still alive in the ruins. Walker, please, save my family. Shadea kept pushing to leave. Elir Sudro insisted we stay. And then he told her everything. The relic took them to the ruins. The relic is the price of their lives. Too late for me, Walker. Please, find the Lark. Save the others. Everything went off without a... Wait. Where is everyone? What happened here? Did you do this? I knew Relasi was desperate to get me, but I never thought she'd order something like this. Shadea? Why did he tell her? That old cat is too quick to assume the good in everyone. You think the Bandari are paying me? They could barely afford to pay their mercenaries. The Lark of Rosgard never leaves a job unfinished. Stealing is so inelegant a word for what I do. I prefer to think of it as reacquisition. And the simple answer is that some things are much better earned than bought. Trust. When we get to the ruins, I need you to barter with Shadea. Do whatever you can to keep her occupied with a talisman. I'll meet you at the ruins. Remember to keep Shadea talking as long as possible.
take first blood. Anything I'm <laughs> Bleed out the elder. Where is the thief? Should they have pleased? This one is sure that Walker means no harm. We can talk through this, yes? You should have kept your nose to yourself, Walker. This does not concern you. What? Where did you. It does not matter. Give it to Shadea, now! With so many hands grasping for it, someone must pay well for it, yes? Shadaya is losing patience. Toss it over now! What was that? No! Curse you, thief! No! You will pay for this, Walker! Surrender the talisman or the others die! Please, Walker. Save this one's family. Give her the talisman if you must. That's Relasi. Follow my lead and play along. Stop right there! You've tricked me out of the talisman, but you'll never catch me alive! Scoundrel! Thief! Pariah! This Go one now. is not injured, Walker. Perhaps it is a better fate than he deserves. This one misplaced his trust and now pays dearly for it. Those who tried to fight back were killed. Please, Walker. None of this was worth it. I came as quickly as I could. As soon as I saw what happened at the camp, I followed the tracks here to the outpost. I'd have been here sooner, but High Priest Trelum kept badgering me with questions. He hasn't even realized his precious relic was replaced with a fake. When I got there, he'd taken it off the pedestal and was clutching it to his chest. While there are lives at stake, I couldn't give a nix. If you can go after them, I'll escort the Elder here safely out of the caverns. My thanks, Walker. You are a true friend, Ulibandari. This one shall pay your favor forward. Oh good. I was starting to get worried. The others just passed me. They're safe. Now all that remains is to decide the fate of the Talisman of St. Voris. She wouldn't. The only person Relasi wants to suffer for this crime is me. 
and she still needs to catch me. Way ahead of you. While you were saving the hostages, I doubled back and managed to steal Relasi's replica off the High Priest personally. Serves him right. So I could give it to you. Will you honor the patron saint of House Telvanni by restoring his shrine's most beloved spoil of war? Or will you don the mask of the pariah and deliver them the replica? The choice is now yours. For everyone involved to keep their desired reputations, there is no one else I can trust with this decision. It has to be you. I mean, I know what I'd do, but it's in your hands now. Relasi has made things hard for herself, remaining a decent person in her line of work. Even her making that replica was done with the best of intentions. Chasing someone for so long with little to no headway can't be easy. She deserves a win. When we've just started having fun? No, no. The Lark's got plenty of work to do, believe me. Relasi follows a code, as did Saint Voris, as do the Bandari. As I do, and I'm sure you do too. Our codes clash and harmonize. Most of the time, they pass in quiet opposition. No, no. See, the important thing here is that Relasi didn't catch me. In fact, you looking like you caught me works in my favor. Trust me, she needs the encouragement. It'll keep her from giving up. My reputation wouldn't be half of what it is today without Relasi making me notorious. That's a valuable thing to have in a long-term adversary. As far as Relasi knows, you only have the original talisman. If you give the original to Elior Sudro and the replica to Relasi, she'll have to pretend it's the real thing, or get herself in a whole world of trouble by admitting how she lost it. Then you'll have honored the tribunal and saved the shrine of St. Voris from a fate of worshipping a worthless trinket with no real mystical properties for time immemorial. Or, perhaps they'd be doing that either way. Who can say? See you around, Street.